touch wood, it seems to be going good. Greetings friends, it's the 2nd of January. Uh, I don't know if I remember I told you, I had to super glue the, one of the wind cups back on and I'm amazed that it's actually still working okay. Uh, the wind has changed direction as you can see by the vane, usually it would be pointing behind me. Unfortunately the turbine the other night was extremely windy and started making lots of horrendous noises. So unfortunately I had to put the brake on, which uh, isn't pleasant when it's 40 mile an hour wind because that made loads of horrendous noises. So I'm just going to go and remove the brake and see if it starts working. I'm not sure if it's windy enough, but we'll see. It's then 5.5 mile an hour max, so 6.4 degrees. There's the three wires coming in from the turbine and they had to be joined up using a, a clamp. And there's the three cables that needs to go back in. Well, it looks like we might be in luck. It appears to have released the brake okay. That's what the solar panel's making right now. Not sure there's enough wind to get it going, but it doesn't look like there's any serious problems. I think the noise was actually coming from a wobble in the tail which when it gets quite high frequency sounds horrendous so what i'll need to do is put some beams going from the main uh the tail i think it's called the boom uh the long bit of tubing something needs to come off the middle of there and connect with the tail to stop it shaking so much but i'll get you posted uh if we get any wind cheers She's trying. Doesn't seem to be any obvious uh, mechanical issues. Other than it's not going fast enough. Clink, clink. Yeah, we've just got to see if the wind gets up at all. See, that's a 28 tooth sprocket on the drive wheel and an 18 tooth sprocket on the bike motor, but they could both do with replacing. Go on, girl. That won't be making 24 volts. Yeah. So it seems to be spinning nice and freely. At the moment I've got the solar panel plugged in, the beat up solar panel, and it's fairly sunny so that the turbine is going to struggle to get over that voltage. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to disconnect that and the battery voltage will drop down quite quickly. Right, so I'll unplug the solar panel now. Well, I'm just going to record that for 10 minutes and then I'll speed it up and we'll see if we get any wind. Well, it seems to be making something, even if it is only a tiny bit. I'm just going to show you what happens when I plug the solar panel back in. Watch the voltage leap straight up. So, yeah, anyway, I just thought I'd show you that was working again. So sweet. Hopefully we'll get another windy day very soon and we won't have any problems. Cheers.